It's 7 o'clock p.m. on Monday, October 2nd, 2023. And I've decided to move them into the southern part of this last section. The reason why is because we got trees there and trees there. It's going to be 90 degrees tomorrow. I figure those trees might be useful for some shade. I don't have any trees down in the beginning of the section, so I'll give them this last part of the section. We've got some okay grass. It's pretty dry in this part of the field. It's nothing to write home about. In fact, it might be a little less than what they need. Uh, this area here, I don't know why it's so dead. It doesn't really make sense to me why this is so dead. It looks like we got some spring grass or something growing. That's what this is. But then in the summer, nothing really came through. This, this I think, is a summer. It's a warm season grass. So, But I see lots of leaves, which suggests maybe the leaves are blocking out the sun or something. I'm not exactly sure. You just ate that grass plant. <laughs> There's plenty of grass in the goat weed, though. Get out of here. You got all those flies on you. Look at you. Oh. Whoa! They're all coming. I hear over there the fence popping. I'll probably check it out. I gotta move the water. The water's down there in the middle of the field. I have to move it up here near the tree so they can get some water. They don't need the water right now though. I'll bring it to them tonight. And then uh, I gotta feed the ducks. I forgot to bring duck feed to the duck pond. And chicken feed to the chicken coop. I'll feed the ducks though tonight. Yeah, it's popping really loud. I don't know if you guys can hear it. I definitely can. I'll check that out. Oh, Blackie's not the last one this time. It's Dusty and Dusty's bowl. Come on. You gonna go number 20? Young 20? With your horns? Young 18. I'm gonna keep him. He's a bull. I like his colors. He has the uh, eyeliner too. Alright, that's it. I'm gonna put the wire back up now. I don't see any more cows. <coughs> Yeah, it's pretty dry. Uh, we're in uh, severe drought D2, and there's rain expected Wednesday, an inch and a half, last I checked, and then another half inch on Thursday. After that, the weather's gonna cool down. So. If you remember, quite a few months ago, I hurt myself trying to get the wire off a fence. Um, I have this thing here. It's a, it's a conductor with the spring on the inside. And so I can just hook that directly to the fence. It'll make a good contact. And the spring helps us to, it helps us, do I got it tangled up on my knife? The spring helps us to uh, keep tension on the wire. So, there you go. See, just hook it up just like that. And you get a nice tension on the wire, which is good. Gives a little bit of play. So. I could move it closer to the stud. Kind of doesn't matter too much. I don't hear the popping anymore. Probably another grasshopper. Oh, there's lots of little patties all over the place here. 
I heard a cow make a donation next to my side by side. I want to see what that was about. Oh, my side by side. It was running sluggish, and I'm like, oh. I need to take it to the shop. You know, change all the fluids too. I haven't done that for a long time. Um, but then as I was driving it, I go, you know, it feels like there's not enough air. Yeah, this is the donation Dusty gave me. A little watery. Yeah, the fence is still poppy. So I, I finally said that it's probably just like an air filter or something. So let me just show you how easy that is to get to. This thing here. And this thing was packed full. It was just packed full of goat weed seeds. It already picked up quite a few. So, I mean, I could get a new air filter, but I probably do need a new air filter. It works. Now I can go 20 miles an hour. Um, yeah, I probably should get a new air filter. That was all it was. Just a one-handed fix job there. I had to go and blow out the stuff. And I closed my eyes to do it. So I wouldn't get it in my face. Let me show you how to I'm get in there like it. I'm get in there. There you go. Pop. And the same with the one in the back. Can't see it very well. There we go. Pop. All fixed. This is where the stuff comes in. I tested that. I tried to cover it. And sure enough, I made a vacuum. So it's just sucking up goat weed um, into here, the goat weed seeds. This thing is covered in goat weed seeds. It's just all over the place. And uh, yeah, I probably should wash this thing every once in a while. Anyway, <laughs> yeah. These machines they build for the farm, they build them. Extra tough. I don't hear the popping anymore. Nope, there it is. Alright, I'm going to go check it out, guys. Have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.